Hey everyone, this is Glass Eater back with another video review of the Left 4 Dead Smoker. The front of the package shows the smoker with his accessories, while the back has a short paragraph about the smoker. So let's get him out of the package. So we have ourselves another nasty looking zombie from the Left 4 Dead series. It's a really good sculpt and the paint on him makes him always look slimy and dirty. The smoker is covered in an infection that makes him grow tongues all over his body. He uses them to pull his victim to him. They call him the smoker because he's constantly coughing from the gas the infection it creates around him. Let's look at some of the detail. Let's look at articulation. He has a joint for his neck, although he can't move it much because of all the infection. His shoulder, but also again it is hindered by the infection. His elbow. His wrist. He has a joint in his torso, which lets him lean all the way around. He can rotate his waist. And his thighs move in all directions. Now his pants and his t-shirt are made of a softer plastic, so you can bend them any way you want. His knees are articulated. And finally, his ankles. Now the smoker comes with two tongues, a short and a long tongue. They both have a metal wire in them so you can bend them which way you want. And they are easily attached to the smoker's mouth with a peg. The long tongue fits just like the short one. The smoker also comes with another tongue in the back of his head that also has a wire in it, allowing you to bend this one also. The other tongues in his head do not have a wire in them, but they are still made of the same material. Now the smoker is a tall zombie, and here he is next to the boomer. The smoker is usually hunched over and looks more natural when not standing up straight. Overall, it's a great addition to the Left 4 Dead figures. If you love the boomer, you will love the smoker. He's out in stores now, so happy hunting. Thanks for watching.